Hi, I'm Ellie. Welcome back to Tech3x channel. Today I'm going to show you how to use Google Sheets app on your phone. You can find the desktop version of this tutorial in the course up here. Today I'm going to show you how to install the app and how to create and edit the spreadsheet on your Android phone, iPhone, and iPad. Okay, enough talk, let's jump to the tutorial. The first step is downloading the app. You can use the Play Store or App Store. I use the Play Store and search for Google Sheets. Now I install and open it. This is the main page. You can see or change your Google account via this icon. When I tap on that, I can change my account or add another account. The icon next to it is for uploading files. You can upload a spreadsheet from your Google Drive or device storage. On this part of the page, all the spreadsheets that you were created are available. And you can select any of them and modify it. For example, I choose the first one and the spreadsheet will open. Via this icon, you can sort your spreadsheet. And with this icon, you can change the view. Okay, let's create a new spreadsheet. When you tap on this plus sign, you have two options. You can choose a template or a new one. I choose new, and like the desktop version, there is one sheet with rows and columns. If you need more than one sheet, tap on the plus sign. If you tap on the little drop down arrow, it gives you different options. You can create a duplicate of the sheet, delete it, and rename it. Let's rename the sheet. When you type in the name, tap on OK. As you can see, the sheet name changed. Again, I tap on the drop down arrow to see our options. You can hide the sheet or even change the color. Let's see. Here there are basic and custom colors. I choose this red. As you can see, a red line appears. You can turn the grid lines off or on. You can move the sheet right or left. There are freeze, rows, and columns options. And I will tell you how to work with these options later. For selecting the cell, Tap once on a cell, and if you want to type in the cell, double tap, or you can tap once on this field. The keyboard will appear. I type in the headers, name, address, and phone number. You have four many options down here. You can change the size. Make it bold, change the color. You can make the text middle, right, or left. Change the color of the cell. With these two icons, you can insert rows and columns. Up here, there are other options. These are really an undo options. By this A icon, you have more formatting options for text and cell. For example, with borders, you can have a border for the cell or change the style of the border. You can wrap text, merge the cells. For merging the cells, choose the cell, then drag it. Now choose merge. Via the plus sign, you can insert comments, charts, images, and columns and rows. When you tap on the comment, this field will open, and you can type in the comment. Now by the comment icon next to the plus sign, you can see the comment. Now let's freeze the first row. Tap on the little drop-down arrow next to the sheet name. Then down here, choose how many rows or columns you want to freeze. Here I need one row and this thick border appears. Now when I scroll the page down, you can see the first row is frozen. Now my edit is finished. To share the spreadsheet, tap on this icon. Here you can add people or groups, 
and share it with your friends and colleagues. You learn how to use Google Sheets app on your phone. If you like this tutorial, please hit the thumbs up. And if you have any question, let me know in the comments and I will answer all of them.